Hello everyone and welcome back to Cop Supply. In this video, I'm going to be giving you an overview of Swiss Oil on the iOS version. So we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. We're going to begin on the home page. As you guys can see on the home page, we have the local time on my mobile device as well as home below it. Then we have the Swift Soul logo on the right. Then we have the notification where it says welcome to Swift Soul. So I can go ahead and check out that. I can hit the clear all button if I wish and it goes in and clears everything. As you guys can see, it says notifications will appear here because I cleared it. Then moving to analytics it shows you successful checkouts which is currently at zero percent and it shows your failed checkouts which is currently at zero percent and you can filter it between today week and all and then we have a purchases section on the home page if you want to click view all it will show you all your purchases because on the limited view on the home it will only show a selected amount now moving to the settings tab it actually shows you the current version at the top left which is swift soul 2.0.3 then you can go ahead and put in your discord webhook url over here you can go ahead and put that in then you can go ahead and configure whether to send webhooks send notifications and use custom delays and it prompts you it says only advanced users should change this setting if you hit ok you can go ahead and change the monitor delay the checkout delay and the error delay i'm going to go ahead and turn it off and just leave it as default then you have the terms of use button the privacy policy button the guides button and the contact button as well as the discord button and the twitter button if you guys want to check that out then the buttons are there and you can also test your webhook once you go ahead and put it in and below that you have the email that you logged into for this account i've gone ahead and blurred it out but that's where you will find your account's email then for the profile section at the top it shows your local time once again it says no profiles tap the addition to create one i'm going to tap the addition and we have a bunch here so let's go ahead and break it down for billing information we have a nickname for the profile as well as your full name email address address line one address line two country phone number city zip code state then for your payment information you have your card type card number expiration and security code and once you are done you can hit save profile so for the profile nickname i'm going to call it video test and then i'm going to go ahead and fill out the rest in a second when you go ahead and go to the country section it actually prompts you with a scroll on so you can go ahead and scroll through until you find your region here and go ahead and select the one appropriate to you and then once you have gone ahead and configured your new profile hit the save profile button it says success your profile was created you can go ahead and back out of that and as you guys can see my video test profile has been created it shows my email and it also shows the last four digits of my card number as well as the type of card moving to the task page we have our local time at the top once again and it says no task tap the addition to create one so if you tap the addition it brings up these task actions start all stop all delete all harvester create task and add gmail so we're going to go ahead and create a task and we're going to go ahead and create a task for the supreme nalgene bottle which is on the screen right now for you guys to check out we're going to go ahead and create a task for that now within the task career you have a few types you have the pre-made you have custom and install sign up so let's say if we were to use pre-made here if i hit this you can go ahead and completely configure it the keywords are already done for you and if we actually scroll down the task creator here the nalgene bottle is already made for us so i'm going to hit on the nalgene bottle the quantity is one the size is going to be not available because there is no sizes available the color i'm going to say it's a black because both black and red are in stock the profile is video test which is the one we configured in this video and the start type is going to be manual so i'm going to hit save task then it's going to say success your task was created i'm going to hit okay i'm going to back out back out once again and as you guys can see my task is ready to go now what i can actually go ahead and do is if i hit this addition button i can go ahead and start all stop all delete all and also a harvester create task and our gmail like i said before however those are for all your tasks if you want to individually do something you simply hit the task you can hit start stop delete edit clone and logs so if i were to clone this it gets cloned like so i can go ahead and delete this as well with the delete button i can hit edit and it pops up the edit task once again so before we actually run this test task we're going to go ahead and hit the addition once again and hit harvester and now as you guys can see the captures will go ahead and appear there so i want to go ahead and start the task here hit start it's going through the process as you guys can see a little green bar will go ahead and progress as it's going through it's asking for captures i'm going to quickly go ahead and solve this give it a second the score isn't the greatest and as you guys can see i solve it and there's a checkout error because the profile is completely made up and if I want to go ahead and stop at any point, I hit the task and hit the stop button. And as you guys can see, the green bar goes away and the task has been stopped. So that concludes the overview of Swift Soul at Cop Supply.